the week. I think you'll like this one. Oh. It's called uh, Be Somebody. Mm -hmm. um, they've already raised a couple million dollars. What it is, is it's a, an app connecting um, passionaries with people wanting to learn. And they're talking about how teaching um, is kind of a lost art. And um, it, in the article, um, the one article I pulled up, it was discussing on how expensive uh, going to college is and how, many, how much loans... A lot of how much loan money people have now out. Um, but what this does is connects people, uh, like for example, if you know how to podcast, if you know how to use a camera, you know how to do makeup, you know, mm -hmm. for a particular genre, and you, connecting them and enabling them to reach people who are also interested in it. When you set this app up, you sign in and then you say what you're passionate about, and um, it'll connect you with people in the area who are offering classes. And so it's offering um, the teachers a way to make money, another way to make fun, you know, raise money for themselves, mm -hmm. and allowing people to learn specific skills that they're very interested in, with um, without having to go take classes at, at a university level or a community college. So I think it, it's really cool. I, I was I just got a chance to check it out today, and um, but they're also hiring. They're accepting applications now for um, ambassadors for local areas. This, this started in just Austin, Texas, but now they're kind of expanding out. Mm -hmm. And uh, they haven't released uh, Android yet, so it's just a, an iPhone thing now. But I think it's, it's, it's a really neat thing and a really unique opportunity, especially in our area with how many makers we have and, and you know, our tech interests and just you know, knitting even, something along those lines, something where you're just passionate about doing things or having an adventure. You host an adventure. Where maybe somebody wants to learn how to ride a dirt bike or how mm. to kayak. I mean, any of these skills that you have that you, you know that you're interested in and you're passionate about, you're able to teach somebody and make money at it. That's awesome. So it's this this kind of it feels like with without the um you know the the, the hangout components, but it feels like what what Helpouts was doing, mm -hmm. where it was kind of connecting you and giving you this place to say, hey, I'm an expert in X. Let me help you. Mm -hmm. that, like that seems like what's going on here. That's it's really interesting. Yeah, it's it's very it's very neat. It's the app itself is very nice. It's very bright. It's easy to use, and it's just I, I, I'm really I'm really interested in to check it out further. It mm -hmm. seems like it would be the perfect complement or supplement to bridge from pod camp to pod camp. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <clears throat> you have people that are passionate. They have the ability to teach to keep that teaching going year round. I, I think this is like the perfect tool for that. Mm -hmm. I need help setting up a Twitter account. I need help. I mean, it's right. pretty much anything mm -hmm. up mm -hmm. to actual real life adventures, you know, in the real world beyond the tech. Learn how to surf. How does it connect people? Like, like, is it, is it sit you up and you do a meeting or is yeah, it you, like you a connect video? online first and okay. then you meet in person. Okay. So it's, it's a lot of, there's some verification involved. So you're not just like showing up and it's somebody going, Hey, and they're crazy. Awesome. <laughs> not too terrible. <laughs> no, you know, crazy in the uh, scary regards, not like crazy like we are. <laughs> <laughs> which we're safe we're just fun so i mean it's it's it's, an, it's a nice way to say i mean it could be a nice way to supplement your income while mm -hmm. doing something you really enjoy awesome i actually got to load it up here so mm -hmm. i'm gonna i'm gonna poke around at this a little bit where is that there it is with everything else going on uh and there's our chat room too oh look they have cat, cat hands paws. there's cat hands showing you how this works you find people around all right you book your experiences from local experts called passionaries mm -hmm. okay that's interesting that's fun and then you get on a dirt bike and what the heck we're riding a dirt bike they're really loving this dirt bike uh, uh kind of mechanism here aren't they my so gosh I'll, and, I'll and if you look at the, the passion things my stuff. It, there's um anything from bulldogs to uh, i think it was um decorating apartments small apartments like anything you could ever imagine having a passion about there it's, it's pretty much on that list that's awesome. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm going to look into this a bit. Mm -hmm. You know, Cause, Cause, I mean, even with coding, I mean, how many people we know could have co you know do this or even wanting to attend it? Since oh, I, yeah. I can't, I don't have the kids software that they all have now. <laughs> we have action sports. We have acting. We have somebody periscoping me. Acro yoga. What the yeah. heck? So they picked some very interesting things to start mm -hmm. off with. Mm -hmm. So, and I'm just in the A's. Alpine yeah. climbing, alternative music, America. What do we have in America? Um, let's see. Hashtags be somebody, 30 seconds to Mars, 3D, uh, 3D modeling, okay. Let's see what we got. Uh, everybody's texting me. I know. Stop texting me. So wait, <laughs> oh, oh, I'm supposed to select my passions. Oh, okay. I am not a 3D modeler. We're going to back up on that. We'll finish yeah. that later, but you get mm -hmm. the idea. That looks like a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Definitely going to look they into that. They said that some of the uh, the passionaries have made $3,000 in a month. I'm in. 
<laughs> it's like sold. Everybody's in. I'm in. And so, yeah. everybody's going to, uh, until everybody floods into this thing. And then So we're first. Pittsburgh, we're first. We're first. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Not anybody else there talking you go. about I'm going to finish signing up for that in between you. shows here. But in the meantime, uh, hey, check out our friends. Uh, we, we're also passionate about pizza around here. Aren't Is we? that an option? Is that, oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me look it up. Let's see. Pizza, Passion option? Pizza. pizza. No results. Oh. You can start it. Whoa. We're going we're bringing we're making this happen. We're bringing pizza to be somebody and we're hoping to help a uh, slice on Broadway bring pizza to you. If you're in the South Hills of Pittsburgh here, uh, go check them out. They help us out. They support it so these fine fine people can uh, sit through their dinner hour here on the couch and not be hungry. It is tasty and delicious. Yes. <laughs> I recommend ordering not just one pie, minimum 3. You gotta order three. If you're gonna order one, you gotta order three. Yeah, because you want lunch the next day. You want. You gotta taste <laughs> all the snacks. different gourmet ones. Oh, oh it's delicious. Mm -hmm. uh, go check them out. Hey, the, the Dutters. We just went to uh, Slice uh, Thursday night on a whim. Yeah, we just we went out there and enjoyed all the delicious pizza, and mm. we love the guys there are so awesome. The guys and the ladies there are just so. They such, are. And they anything to, anything to take care of you. Anything you need, they're like, do you need this? That's just awesome. Awesome. There's Rico on the front page right there. Uh, go Rico. check them out and uh, tell them you heard about them on the awesome cast, uh, sliceonbroadway.com. They're in Carnegie in the South Hills along the tracks and Beachview, as well as the Main Street. Wait, I just mixed things up, didn't I? In the Main Street of Carnegie on Main Street. Yeah. Okay. They're all the places. Sliceonbroadway.com to find out those actual places, because I'm mixing them up. Uh, PJH underscore Slice on the Twitters, and uh, Slice on Broadway on your Instagrams and Facebooks. Thank you so much for supporting the show. Now let's go check out what happened last week at Sorgatron Media.